couple years ago, I was wrestling with my cousin. I landed on my shoulder and I was like 18. I'm like, yeah, no big deal. It won't be a problem later in life, you know? I'm young. You want to be up the chest a little bit? Good. Ever since then, it's been popping and ripping out of socket. When Matt Peary's shoulder injury started getting in the way of his job. What we need to do, we need to access your shoulder. His doctor sent him to CDI for an arthrogram. One of the reasons we do the arthrograms is because when we inject fluid into a joint before we do an MR, we get a lot of additional information about the joint, especially the lining of the joint, uh, the uh, structures that hold the joint and support it, like the labrum and the shoulder and the hip. Um, those are things that we wouldn't see as well if we didn't have fluid in the joint ahead of time. Just, you know, it burns a little bit. Yeah. The procedure involves using needles to inject fluid into the joint, usually a hip, shoulder, wrist, elbow, or knee. The main concern is people don't like to have needle procedures, so we reassure them that one, it's very fast, two, we use local anesthesia, and three, that uh, it is actually a very thin needle that doesn't hurt as much as they would think. Feel any pressure or pain or something? No. We really can relax the patient. It's all in the technique and how you talk to them. And you know, you take your time with them and um, you get most of those patients through. After the fluid is injected, the MRI scan captures images of the joint, which helps your doctor plan your treatment. Just trying to get this done as soon as possible. So they're just pushing it off and making it worse. For Matt, that may mean surgery, but it will hopefully bring relief.